everyone welcome back and this is Navin from UI Brands. So in this video we are going to discuss a basics about Node.js. So how to run a Node.js program. Okay. So before we start with uh, uh, this Visual Studio code and all editors and all I tell you generally where you execute a JavaScript program. Okay. First tell me before we start with Node.js first tell me JavaScript. Right. So where you execute a JavaScript program you will execute a JavaScript program on the browser correct because uh, browser having internally the JavaScript engine so you must have to execute JavaScript program on the browser correct so to execute a JavaScript program on the browser so what are all you have to do you may have to create one HTML you may have to create one H, uh, CSS and one JavaScript and you have to connect all together and you write something console uh, uh, console logs in the JavaScript and we'll see those console logs in the browser console window okay this much process is there instead of doing HTML CSS JavaScript and all this we can directly execute a JavaScript program on the browser guess what yes console window okay so we can execute a JavaScript program directly without using HTML and CSS Just plain JavaScript program we can execute on the browser using the uh, console window right same like that for node.js also we have a uh, kind of console window that's called REPL environment okay so let's see how to execute a JavaScript program and then uh, uh, this REPL environment we'll see so first of all let me show you the JavaScript program how to execute in a browser and then we'll see uh, the node.js REPL environment okay so let me open a browser um, here let me right click inspect console okay uh, let's remove everything yeah this is my console window and this is the direct access to the node.js uh, so I mean JavaScript engine so you can write a program uh, I write console console dot log off you can just say uh, welcome welcome to browser okay something i write a simple javascript uh, statement console log and press enter see what happens it executes and displays the welcome message welcome to browser and this is nothing but a written type of log message so log message doesn't have written type so it just says undefined just ignore this you get the answer as welcome to browser okay and you can also print something called uh, today's date console.log of uh, new date see this is the today's date and this time okay and I just print the uh, proper time okay so console.log of you just say new date dot to locale uh, time string is a function enter you get the current time 3:26 p.m. okay so what are we doing here is we are having a direct access to the uh, JavaScript engine through the browser console window and we can execute the plain JavaScript program using this browser same story also applicable for node.js so node.js is an environment which also having a same v8 engine which is there in the chrome and uh, this allows to execute a JavaScript program but where you execute a JavaScript program in the node is your command prompt generally if you know uh, C language or Java C++ so where you execute that uh, generally we execute on the command prompt right same way we can execute the node.js program on the command prompt so let's see how to execute the same program on the command prompt using node.js okay so let me open a command prompt here CLS clear screen okay so how to execute node.js program is you have to, to shift to to uh, a new environment called REPL generally for browser we have console window correct so it's for node.js we have a REPL environment so what is REPL is R stands for read okay we can read we can perform read operation E stands for eval and the P stands for print we can print it and L stands for um, loop okay you can loop it so you can do these many type of operations using this environment so how can you switch to this environment from command prompt is very simple uh, open a command prompt here you can just type node nothing else just node enter 
See now it is switched to the REPL environments. Now we can write the JavaScript program. Uh, it's quite simple. Same kind of programs we write over here. So I say console dot log of uh, welcome to Node.js. Okay, this press enter. See, we get the same answer which we got over here because both are using a same V8 engine. Okay, fine. And let's make a data. So console dot log of new date uh, enter. See, you get the rate object and undefined. Okay, and you want to get the time. So just say console dot log of new date dot to locale uh, time string. This is the current time of uh, now. Okay. So we can execute a JavaScript program here. You can even declare variables. Let a is equal to uh, 10. Okay. Let b is equal to 20. Okay. Let sum is equal to a plus b. And uh, console dot log of uh, sum. What is some value? Uh, 10 plus 20 is 30. We get the answer 30. So you can execute a JavaScript program just like on the command prompt using Node.js. Okay, but one problem is there in this approach. What is the problem? If you go to browser, what is the problem if you write a JavaScript program here? Problem is, if you just refresh the browser, your program is gone. Okay, and same story here. If I do Control C, it is exited, right? Control C, it exits. If I say CLS, gone your program okay so why are we using this console window is just for testing purpose and same way this repl environment also for testing purpose okay to test us a quick uh, javascript program we can use this okay if you don't have editors available you can quickly test it using this environments used to okay but this is not a real uh, you know real real world approach to run a javascript programs using node.js we need to have a uh, editor okay fine so now okay this is enough for uh, creating a uh, i mean executing a node.js program and then in the next video what we see is uh, how to use editor and how to set up node.js and then how to write a programs with node.js and those things we'll see in the next video thank you